Hello, today we are talking about the reopening of cinemas. Are you ready to go back? As the pandemic broke out in early 2020, major blockbusters such as A Quiet Place 2 and the live-action version of Mulan were quickly pulled from the schedule even though tickets were already sold. Disney was equally quick to postpone Black Widow and MGM did the same with the latest Bond film No Time to Die. Universal was foreseeing enough to put the ninth entry of the Fast and the Furious franchise one year ahead into 2021. A move that was scoffed at at the time by many, but in hindsight, Universal did the right move. As cinemas closed, we have been watching films from the safe comfort of our homes on streaming services. There is now a jungle to choose from, each of them having a huge library full of content. But now, starting in mid-May, cinemas are beginning to reopen across the world. But the question is, are you ready to go back to the cinema? Watching a film with a big audience is a unique experience. But with so much content available with just a click on the remote from the sofa, have we become too comfortable to go back to the cinema? Back in the day, going to the cinema was the only way to watch a new film. The release on home media could be about six months or later after its initial theatrical run. But in recent years, some films have been simultaneously released on streaming and physical media as well as a limited theatrical run. That have been the case for mostly smaller titles, not the big blockbusters for which a theatrical release is very important to bring in the big cash. That might be about to change however. Disney have started giving us a choice for their customers on their streaming service Disney+. Plus. For example, expected blockbuster Black Widow, which will have a cinema premiere later this summer, will be available on their streaming service on the same date for an additional cost. So in the end, I like that the studios are giving us the option to make up our own minds on how we want to see the films. From the comfort of our home or in the cinema. I know a lot of people who don't frequently visit the cinema. Maybe they have small children at home and it's not easy to get away. Or maybe they don't like the hassle of getting to the cinema. Maybe they find the viewing experience of equal value from home. After all, home cinemas are getting better by the day, so why not? For me, who loves going to the cinema, I would prefer to seek out an IMAX screening if possible. But if I was unable to, if the cinemas are still close to my country, I can still see the new releases when they're still new without having to consult an illegal service. Which we shouldn't. How do you prefer to watch a film? Do you want to go back to the cinema or do you think it's too early? Is this just a way for the film industry to kickstart the business without thinking about safety first? Please leave a comment below, let me know what you think about this. Hit the like button and subscribe to my channel, that would be highly appreciated. Thank you so much for watching and see you at the cinema. Or not. Bye bye.